Hi. Hello and welcome. It's time again. This is yes. an Erna show. It is. Your weekly dose of of yeah. us. No therapy. <laughs> of, of us. Of spirituality. Of life. Of business. Mindset and coaching and oh, business and my gosh. So, if you um, enjoy watching us, mm -hmm. follow, like, subscribe. subscribe. Oh, and hit that bell. Yeah, you did it. <laughs> <laughs> so, please do, at least for Anna. She's yeah. been practicing a lot. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I have. I have. You have. Oh, man. So, so today... What are we going to talk about today? We're going to talk about we're going spirituality. Um, yeah, yeah. Again, maybe or well, we're going spirituality. I feel like it because I am an energy healer, but I learned how to use it years and years and years ago. So and now I got the opportunity to um, do a study energy healing um, with a subsidy from the government what else is better just free study you have to explain that to me a what it's it's like an allowance or mm. um, in this case the the government um, has a budget and they have certain um, uh, studies trainings courses that are within that budget so you get a thousand euro and then you can um can subscribe to to, to a study yeah do, do you need to have do you need to i know you're working so it's not like you have to be no. out of a job no, or... it's what they what they want to stimulate is that um people that are without a job um find something that they like and that they can um, develop themselves in, mm. maybe set up an own, their own business or uh, create more opportunities for themselves in the, um, the job market. And for people with their own businesses, um, yeah, just to maybe find a niche or find another niche or, uh, well, at least develop. Um, yeah. So your skills and your, yeah yeah wow. yeah. Get so some... you just have to apply and then, or is it something that you just click and then you get it? No 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 no. You do have to apply. Okay. Because they have like it's a certain amount of money that they have per uh, quarter of the year. Mm. Every quarter of the year they have uh, just a budget. Yeah. And if you're too late, yeah, then you have, then you try again next quarter. Um, I was too late in the first quarter, but or just yeah, the first quarter, but mm. the second quarter was Nailed right it. on time. Good, and I got it. You got now, it. Okay, now I'm expanding my knowledge and um, refreshing my knowledge mm. about energy healing. And it's amazing. I'm at the third, the third module, and I have learned so much already that you know I vaguely knew or I knew of, but now it's getting more and more clear. And I can also that's why I, you know, um when we had the podcast where I did the the intuitive drawing for you that I mm -hmm. said about the colors around you. That's that started again because we have these exercises that we can do. So, for instance, lie down in the in the grass and just look up at the sky, but like looking, staring, mm. and then you see all of a sudden you see ripples of energy or small balls that are just shooting through your vision. Okay, and look at trees just sit down look at the tree also again looking staring and you'll yeah. see the 
around the tree, you will see the aura and also in, at the, the border of the aura, you can see those little, little um, energy balls just popping in and out and going. Those balls. That's yeah, it's just, it's just like marbles or maybe even smaller. So when you see an aura, it's like small marbles. No, just the outline. Just good. the outline. Yeah. It's not good, but it, that was Is that for your head? Yeah. So that you, uh, yeah, but also, you know, also on your, on your head. Mm. Yeah. You, yeah. I can get to that point where I see like a white or invisible kind of layer. And it sounds weird calling it invisible when I can see it, but it's, it's like there is a, a line that yeah. I can see. And then there's, a, yeah. Yeah. I can't remember if I mentioned this the last time we spoke, but the thing about really staring into the sky or on a tree. Yeah. But that's what I did in a mirror, <laughs> standing <laughs> at myself. And it was really, really creepy. But, after, but that's actually how it works. Yeah, because I, I, I figured out that I had, and again, the whitish um, thing around. And that's why I asked if it were marbles all around, because I just saw this. Kind of like Jesus when he's on the uh, in church where he has this thing, but that's, that's Oreo. That's, but that's, that's an Oreo. I saw that's not what I saw, but but kind of the same shape. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, so that's that, a way we can practice. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, for sure, for sure. And you know, it, it, it most of the time it doesn't happen uh, like the, you you just stare and it just. Mm -mm -mm. there no it can nope. it can take a while you know um but but it's it's a, it's so great to to have that again because i used to have it and it was overwhelming and i just sort of shoved it away mm. um and now now i'm just in, indulging myself in it again and so it's wonderful do you see it all the time or can you switch well it i can sort of switch it off um but now i'm i'm doing it on purpose although if you look at people it's like that you're like stare looking at that people. would have been me <laughs> and then not directly at them but slightly to the side you don't you don't stare like that <laughs> That's what I do to focus. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that's why it was creepy looking in the mirror because I scared yeah. myself. <laughs> yeah. And I think that's why it's good practicing on trees because they don't move. Yeah. No. <laughs> oh, no, true. Okay, the leaves might uh, and the branches might. Uh... Yeah, but but that that doesn't matter because the mm. form itself mm. is static. So you you can just see and you can see the aura moving with the tree. But now you mention a tree does it also have different colors or is it just whitish or does White it have green. colors of green okay so you wouldn't see red no tree. no yeah. because the a tree is like uh, it's it's healing it's uh yeah okay and that's and that's more that energy so a new question yeah so if you look on humans yeah. they have how many different uh, colors um well they've got seven layers but the colors are um a lot a multitude of colors okay Only so it's not the first, it's not the first seven layer. like the chakras yeah it's uh, the colors of the chakras are in the second layer mm. and um okay so the first layer is always um like a milky white yeah blue white and that's I think most people uh, find that easiest to see. Okay. Easier. Easier. <laughs> it took right. a while. Easier. <laughs> Easier to see. <laughs> okay. I know what I'm doing tonight. <laughs> I'm going to the bathroom staring at myself. <laughs> Can I still do it? I don't know. Okay. And then... Um, oh. Sorry, I'm bumping. Um, and then the second layer has the the aura colors, like the the bright 
red, orange, yellow, green, um, blue. Those are that's in in the second layer. Mm. Then the third layer is um, like a soft green, completely. Mm -hmm. It's com a complete soft green layer. And the fourth layer is more like past. Do you call that past pastels? Like mm -hmm. raw uh, pink, but then soft pink and soft green, uh, yellow, uh, um, peach color, you know, soft blue. Mm. Um, and then the fifth, the fifth layer is actually quite. <laughs> the fifth, the fifth layer is actually quite um, interesting, because that's a layer that can be as, um, if you imagine it, it's empty, and a lot of debris, um, nasty, negative stuff can be put in there but you sort of if you imagine you can um vacuum it you pull it you pull it like in a vacuum mm. and then it becomes hard as a diamond and it shines like, like a diamond so nothing would still be in that layer or would it be removed the, the negativity will be removed mm -hmm. And the, diamond and the would layer be is just, and it's it's still empty. It, the color it's 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 translucent or mm -hmm. transparent, but it's it's hard as a diamond, so it protects you. But it can go through all the other layers, so there is like the layers of your body mingle. The colors, oh yeah, and what you can't see right now inside my body. <laughs> Is a little girl or perhaps a 43-year-old woman going, yay, that's exciting, that's exciting, I want to know more. <laughs> that's my next hyperfocus. <laughs> <laughs> but it didn't look like that, did it? I look really no, calm. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> very, very calm and composed. Yeah. And there's another layer, right? Yes. There's a, a sixth and a seventh layer. Mm -hmm. And the sixth layer is uh, silver. Mm -hmm. Um, and the seventh layer is the golden layer. And you can, I, I do this meditation now. Um, and the golden layer, it's like it's like an, an egg, an eggshell, but flexible. Mm. And it, it keeps the, the bad things out, the negativity out. But it's doing a good job if you have a layer that is to um to have the negativity in it okay so sorry again can, can you, can if, you... if you have a layer yeah. that has all the negativity in it yeah well it's not only um like the golden the, the golden layer just keeps out the negativity from outside but okay, so, so it's your own internal, negative. yeah. Oh, okay. So mm -hmm. uh, uh, anger, uh, sadness, um, negative words that you say to yourself. Oh, where did we hear that before? I don't know. I've heard it before as well. I can't remember. Mm, no, I'll... it will come to me in a minute. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I knew it. For those of you who know Marissa Pierre, you know what we're talking about. <laughs> yes. But but Anna, um, that now I'm becoming the question person because the golden layer is to protect us from the negativity from outside external but what if someone says something hurtful to you then it comes in sometimes it does yeah yeah it does sometimes it does come in and that's and that's um like we we have we're not always on guard, you mm. know. Also, the um, you will you have to actively clean the layers and uh, fill the fill them with the colors, and um, so you you do have to actively manage manage your aura. Mm -hmm. Do you say that? I think so. I I, I think of it like um, your garden. If you don't, yeah. Exactly. That it will be filled with weed and yeah, 
some stuff you don't want exactly. in your, like my garden right now but it's becoming better because <laughs> we're doing something about it I'm going to do good it. good yeah okay so that's the, you do have to take care of it um and I did notice since I'm doing this meditation I um I don't like to drink alcohol anymore I don't like chocolate anymore I it's ridiculous I all the food that is fast food or you know fatty food Just I food don't is. like it anymore it just doesn't taste good that's weird yeah that's really is that weird. a meditation that everyone can use Anna is it something in Dutch that you <laughs> well, <laughs> because I feel like we might have a lot of inquiries about that meditation I can <laughs> uh, I can translate that meditation in English and then um... yeah if you're allowed to if does not if does what if oh. there's copyright on it or something um or we can make our own because we know how to do the that principle well. i know the principle you yeah. know Absolutely. and it's the same it's the same with the rtt stuff mm -hmm. yeah so if you're interested in the uh how do i stop eating junk food meditation just <laughs> write in the comments because we know how to do that and exactly some exactly. great material well, to lean you know, on so i was thinking about this app thing huh oh yeah so we could do meditations like that and then you ha will have to subscribe but you'll have a weekly podcast mm -hmm. and you'll have some other free goodies and but not the meditations nope won't be free nope nope so what the cost is we don't know yet nope exactly but it won't be free but other uh, other stuff won't be about that <laughs> <laughs> yeah yeah we need to look into that because i feel like people want and need it yeah 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 okay so, yeah go so shoot i asked about trees and humans but yeah. what i wanted to ask after that was what about animals do they have the same chakras as we do or yeah yeah, yeah. i thought so okay. yeah and they actually they actually have i don't know if it's more um but they have like like us uh crown third eye throat heart um solar plexus Oh, I don't know what is in English. Root, sacral. There's a root and there's a hara, 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 hara. sacral. Uh, yeah. Anyway, um, but they also have a chakra on their shoulders, mm. and it's it is connected with the heart, but it's it's an ex, sort of an extra chakra. Mm. Yeah. All of the seven layers. Yeah, yeah. I've got questions nice is it easy to to see um what is layer five and what is layer three or do they kind of float into each other they flow into each other but you can um i'm more i can more feel than than actually see at the mo at the moment mm. that will come the more i work with it the easier it is but for now i I can feel with my hands um, above the body, and then I can definitely feel like the a sort of a, a small change in in the feeling. It's okay. yeah, I don't know how to explain that. So, if you were giving a session online, and you would feel how is that even possible, or is it more like you you feel it within and not by yeah i feel it within and i focus on the person all i need to do is have the 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 person's um face mm. in my mind or i can project like a holographic mm. figure of the person um and then i can i can just clear all the the, the negativity out of the aura and find we didn't have that yet 
has to happen one time in the podcast anyways so um so and then i can also <laughs> see <What>? yes <laughs> it's a girl huh mm. always wants the last word yeah and and then i can pinpoint the um the the areas where the issues are and just clean them out as well Okay, so now when I'm looking at you and I'm not, I think it's your background doing something on your right side of your head. So that's your background uh, background doing that, right? Yeah, kind of above and a little bit down your ear. Can you see a color there? Yeah. Yeah, so isn't that just the background teasing? No, there is a color there. But it's it it's difficult because yeah it is my background yeah. yeah but you can see you can see a small difference but I can see it's blue but but yeah. I'm yeah but it, can you also easily see your own colors or is it easier to see what others what uh, I can also easily see my own colors so are you yellow today no I'm not yellow. Good, because I can't see that you're yellow, but I had a thought that you were yellow. So I was like, okay, I gotta ask. <laughs> but the bluish thing sticks yes, with blue you. purplish. Yeah. It's it it uh it overlaps and it it's, mm. it mingles a bit. Yeah, the purple is below and the blue is above the yeah. Yeah. But I guess others can see that as well because yeah, if you focus. Oh, and there it went because it's because of your background. <laughs> it's not me. <laughs> hmm. So, can you tell if someone is in love or if they are in pain or if oh, if someone is in financial love, trouble, there's, there's or... this more like pinkish color around them. Mm -hmm. Is the light the light? pink yeah 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 but, but but what about the second layer that was the one with all of the the uh... no that, that's the clear colors the the chakra colors yeah with... but aren't they floating in yeah they're flow they're flowing yeah. in and out but also in and out your body mm. i gotta read about it i gotta learn more <laughs> <laughs> you know once when i went to school and i was about 13 12 or 13 13 perhaps I had a crush on someone who was a year younger than me and um, we had a substitute teacher and I had heard that she knew how to read for us but we went to a catholic school not being catholic but protestantic catholic school yeah we weren't really allowed to talk with her about that but I still did so I went up to her and said well you know um can you tell if that boy over there <laughs> what what if what if I ask him to be my boyfriend would he say yes or no and she said well he will say yes but he's he's not that mature about it or something and she was right <laughs> so oh. that was really crazy <laughs> yeah it didn't last long, but but yeah, but he yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but that's awesome. It was like she explained she could see that there was a um, cord yeah, or a line or something yeah. connected. Yeah, which was really weird because I don't actually think I talked with him before. <laughs> yeah, but you know what? Um, mm -hmm. Your because it's all energy. Yeah, mm. everything also in your aura is energy, and that's why you can get negative energy that you yeah. suck up yeah so if you have your thoughts are energy so if you are having a crush on someone mm. or you are thinking mm. about someone um then there can be a connection already yeah but also if someone for instance is um a soulmate or so mm. then there is already a connection even if you haven't talked to them at all mm. The threat's already there. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. 
Do you have any more questions, Miss? Probably. <laughs> Probably. What are my colors today, Anna? Other than blue, white, and black. Red. <laughs> Red. <Purple>. Oh. <laughs> No, you're green and yellow and yellow. Yellow. Yeah. And what does that mean? Mm. Green was hope, right? Yeah. Green I is hope and healing and heart. Oh yeah, healing. The love yeah. from your heart. Mm. And yellow is the solar plexus, and that's the center of your being, your I, your ego. So maybe have... there's there's you want you have so much to give i do so i accept <laughs> <laughs> i do it sounded so so serious yeah yeah i do and i heard that as well today because someone ah. uh, i practiced with uh doing telepathy she drew a tarot for me yesterday because she thought she would use that in the uh, practice we did. So I yeah. had to tune into that. And there was a mes message in that, um, kind of like linked to what you just said. So that's nice. Mm. It is. It's there. Mm. And now I'm just, I need to know more. <laughs> but I haven't got any <laughs> questions your right mind now, but. How how huge is the field? Is it all the way out here? Uh, up to a just... meter. The layers are are up to yeah, it's quite wow. big, and it can expand and decrease. I guess. Yeah. 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 It's like are a... there, if if you were to look at a murderer, would it more likely be dark colors yeah. or yeah but what if i mean the what if thing now yeah, what yeah. if the murderer was a person who were just hurting because of something and um just happened to do that because of <laughs> circumstances or anything yeah, happened well you happen to kill what someone <laughs> um could it yeah be? you were just you were just in front of my knife yeah what would you, no but if you no, were driving your car or you were being robbed and then you defended yourself and then you accidentally hit someone in the head and it killed them then it wouldn't actually be a murderer murderer and it would just no but you can the see and, and that you can see um but really like really troubled people mm, mm. um yeah you can see that in their aura and you can also if you look um if you have the time and they are okay with it, then you can look deeper and then you will definitely see where it comes from. Because it's, um, if it's like in all the layers of your aura, mm. then it's something that has been haunting you mm. for maybe, well, your whole life is a, is um, a bit an over, uh, over overstated exaggeration mm. that was the word um but yeah you can definitely see that and and that that must be both um a help a helpful for you or for others, others who can do that but it must also be I wouldn't say terrifying, but a bit scary still. Like, yeah. okay, I need to be careful here. And yeah. because even just talking about it, I felt a knot in my stomach and I felt like I wanted to throw up because yeah. of the feelings I would get. Um, but it can be helpful, I guess. Like, yeah, yeah. Of, okay, yeah, for I don't sure. need to. <laughs> for sure. yeah. yeah. When I, when I first um, started to, um, to learn how to how to channel my the energy and how to cope with uh, all the energy coming in and helping people um, heal themselves, um, we I also had to um, had to to practice on on pictures of mm. people and then telling me telling my teacher 
what I uh, saw in them, what the people had. And, and um, I took that to, <laughs> to another level. There was this guy that I knew from a primary school. And um, he he was a, a bit sketchy, mm. but he wanted to to meet up with me and a friend of mine. And my friend couldn't make it, so I went alone. And it was in my uh, in the, in the place that I was born, so I had to travel there. And I stayed with my parents, and it was actually quite quite nice. But there was something I you know that feeling that you sometimes have mm. like I didn't specifically look at his um colors or or whatever but I was on my way home and I already got an app oh, it was mm -hmm. so nice you know and and that evolved and I didn't want to completely shut him down because hey I knew the guy it was a hey he was a, a nice guy and and then all of a sudden he was like yeah can we uh, why don't we uh, come to to where you are now, and uh, and we can go out. And and I was like, yeah, why not? But again, my friend could make it, and I was like, this I don't like it. There's something really, really not. So what I did, I was I, I took a photograph of him that I from LinkedIn or I don't know. I plucked it off the internet. I took the photograph. And you did what, Anna? And I checked his aura. Oh, and you can do that. Yeah. Yeah. And then I told him that I didn't think it was a good idea to come to my place and go out here and stuff like that. It's and like, how did it take that? He wasn't so happy about the way I told him. I thought so. But, but the funny thing is that you actually knew you just had to have... Um, I wanted to confirmation. Yeah. Yeah. Why is it we often need that? We feel it. We, yeah, we feel it. And still we need to check if it could be something else instead of yeah. just believing yeah. what we feel. Yeah, strange, yeah? Yeah. But I so, bet when yeah. you do that, even the more often you do it, the more you start believing on in your intuition. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it was just, you know, I was, I was actually really, really good at reading photographs. Mm. So even so good that my teacher was, he was like, I have never seen someone that picked it up so quickly and so accurately wow now i know what we need to do the next time oh <laughs> it's been a long time since i yeah yeah, yeah 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 i don't care we're going to do it anyway <laughs> <laughs> Gosh. but i don't think we can do it on any living person because if we do that we need their permission yeah yeah so i'm going to find someone <laughs> yeah yeah are you up for it you don't get to say no so she's up for it you yeah. heard it you saw her why not why yeah, not she was nodding yeah why? i know you will i know you can and you're practicing you know you could and you still can you just need to get started and that's what i'm here for i'm here to kick you in the butt and <laughs> yeah, you can be like i don't know yeah you're doing it Push me to go forward. Yeah, go. then you do the same. That's why we're good together because we do. Huh? We are. I mean, I kind of feel like you do sometimes. So, yeah. You know the thing you said about reading him his picture. Um, when I took uh, the numerology course, we um, we have the two triangles on top of each other. You know, I have a whiteboard, but. It's over there, but next time. Next time, Another next time. time. Yeah, yeah. But then we can tune into the solar plexus. And our teacher had done the numeroscope for a person that was real, but we didn't know who it was. And then we were to tune into that person's subconscious. Subcon yeah, 
conscious. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, you know. Um, <laughs> and to, to um, give her words about the person. And that was really, really informative. I can't really know. I don't remember who it was, but it was someone who weren't a good person. Um, Ooh. We have had some really, I think it was, have you heard of Peter Lundin, who lived in the States, the one who painted his face black and white, and he killed his mom, and then he came back to Denmark? Oh. Yeah, I think yeah, I'm getting goosebumps. It was probably him. Um, then he came back to Denmark, and he had a girlfriend who had two children. Oh. And she knew all about his past. No. And now she's not here anymore, and neither are the kids, and we, they never found the bodies. He chopped them. Um, yeah. I think it was him. Ah, uh, crap. Yeah. But that, that's possible as well. Um, yeah. Yeah. Kind of weird. And that is the thing about it's all energy. Yeah. Yes, it is. It is. Because <laughs> it's like literally everybody, everything is connected to the cosmos, mm. to people, to animals, to plants, to everything. Yeah. It, it's so... It's what, it's actually we're so we're so connected that um there actually doesn't have to be a difference in uh status in being rich or poor mm -hmm. or everything everybody is is equal is the same yeah. even though we are we have our un more or less unique because i there are so many doppelgangers going mm. around but mm. anyway we've got our uniqueness and mm. our unique soul but still we're all the yeah. same all connected yeah yeah and i think that's also why um people always say that you can create your own um reality life your life, own yeah. reality yeah your own and it, it feels like no i can't because he's in charge of that and they told me yeah. to do that and that da, 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 da. yeah but in the end if you don't try you'll never know right so why not try exactly yeah you know today when i did the, the telepathy thing i talked to you about it before we started recording but she had to um, tune into something i had chosen for her to figure out what was. Um, and I had to do the same with her. And at some point I had to figure out what she had and it was really difficult. And then, which made no sense at all, I said water bottle. And it wasn't a water bottle, but she was just thinking about a water bottle. And that just confirms that <laughs> we are one. Yeah. Uh, even though I'm here and she is 150 kilom kilometers away sitting with her laptop. So it's yeah. just. Yeah. And I think that's, weird. that's the way that we as humanity are going towards, towards two. Towards what? Where that's the way that we are going. That's the journey that we're on. Yeah. Yeah. So that we can also speak without words and that we know. Um, yeah. And it's about feelings. Yeah. We feel people more than we analyze. Exactly. So, yeah, yeah. exciting, exci <laughs> exciting stuff ahead of us. Yeah. Now it's not so exciting, but. No. Yeah. Some things are things are what you're doing is exciting yes oh for sure for me yeah. it's it's absolutely exciting it's so much fun yeah and i can tell i talked to you the other night and it was like i asked what have you been drinking because you were so <laughs> giddy and <I> was <laughs> giddy and <laughs> water yeah like, <laughs> no chocolate me. bar but i didn't really enjoy it okay yeah. sure that's water <laughs> But yeah, it's fun to be following you on your on your journey. 
Thank you. Well, same here for me, yeah, to follow you on your yeah. journey because, ah, yeah. oh, man, yeah. you're making steps as well. I am. And it's terrifying as F, but it's still, it's, it's like some things I dare not to do and I hold myself back. Yeah. And this, I'm not holding myself back, even though it feels scary, I'm doing it anyway. And it's, it's not as I even have to convince myself doing it. No, exactly. I'm just doing it. Yeah. And maybe it's because it's just how it's supposed to be. Maybe this is how it's supposed to feel, Anna, and not the, come on, get going. You yeah. know you want to do this, get it over with and done. Not over with and done, but just, yeah. yeah. Yeah, the, the, okay. yeah, you know what I mean, right? Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, it definitely is. And I it was funny me. because uh, I posted um, uh, a small video uh, on my Facebook page where I offered the um, energy coaching session for a, a good price. Mm -hmm. And um, one of my friends, uh, apart from you, <laughs> By the way, thank you. But one of my friends uh, sent me a message um, uh, on my on Messenger, and she said, "Oh, Anna, I'm so happy to see you go this way. Mm -hmm. It's it's really really nice to see you making the steps." And I was like, "Oh, thank you very much. Yeah, I, I I'm in love with it." And then she said, "It shows." Yeah, it does. And I didn't even realize, but. I I don't know how many yeah <laughs> I don't know how many times I've rewatched the it's like a, a minute not even 20 seconds or so and I'm just like oh oh it's actually yeah it's actually quite a nice video I I I love what I'm saying and yeah, how yeah. I look and yeah and it shows and people feel that energetically and yeah. then they get drawn to you because yeah and that's yeah. that's really uh, amazing it's amazing to to feel how that works now mm, mm. and you've got the same right after the reading from last week people just yeah I've, i have had uh i have one client tomorrow i had one yesterday i'm having two again next week as it is now um yeah and i just posted the post and i don't what went five ten minutes um and then i had my first um yeah. client and it also says a lot because it could take longer but boom there they were so yeah yeah well you have to have one first eh? and then mm. then it will roll yeah it already is so, it is. so if you want a session with Anna, the lovely Anna, in an energy healing coaching, right, session, yeah. Yeah. just look her up, her digits, <laughs> her details. My her digital, digits. my digital details are down below. Yes, babe. And um, I'm going to get Petra in a moment. And if you want a uh, session with me, exactly, you can find her digital details <laughs> down below as well. And coaching, numerology, I'm blending it all in, I guess. So, um, yeah, but that's the thing, eh? Mm. You start off with one thing, and then you can blend in other mm. other tools that you have accumulated, yeah, uh, over the years. Yeah. And that's really, really nice. Yes. And we're kind of doing the same thing, but not. But not. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So we're both coaching and we're both using uh, the connection with, yeah, with the source. Whatever you may call it, the source, the universe, uh, spirits, whatever. Yeah. But we're doing it differently. So in the end, you kind of get the same, but you don't. Also, because I'm me. And Anna is Anna. <laughs> and you are you. Yes, yes. And you're in Denmark. 
So yeah. for you, it will be Danish and English. Yes. And I'm in the Netherlands. So for me, it would be Dutch and English. Were you about to say Netherlandic? No, I was actually, I actually wanted to say English and Dutch. I was like, oh no, um, my mother tongue is Dutch. So I have to say Dutch first. But what about German? I could probably do German, but I am, I would probably be less confident. Mm, but if someone but were to speak the, German to you and you could reply in uh, Dutch or English, because. Yeah, that would be a f no problem. Because some people don't feel confident in speaking another language, but they do feel that they understand it. Yeah, when, yeah. Yeah. I, I would probably, if someone spoke German to me, I would probably speak german back mm. as as of out of habit so um okay i just have to say i'm not doing doing german because <laughs> i know german and i can speak it a little and i do understand it a little and i have been taught it in school but um no rusty rusty <laughs> but swedish or norwegian could be if you speak slowly <laughs> then I'm good. Well, see? Yep. We're getting places, going yep. places. Mm. So, yeah. So, if okay. you're interested, just let us know, send us in a message. Uh, and again, like, subscribe, hit that bell. Yes, please do. And then we're done for this week. Uh, we are. Wishing you a very happy weekend. Yes. Good weekend. Yes. And stay Hopefully tuned for good. your next dose of the Cat and Anna show. Stay tuned You're here to serve. for your next dose of the Cat and Anna show. Oh, yeah. The, <laughs> the Cat and Anna show. Yeah. Yeah. You can't wait. I know it. But yeah. Oh. She said it all. And yeah, it's the end of the day, and no. <laughs> well, it is the end of the day, but still, okay. Take care. See Take you later. Take care, everybody. Bye.